Hey, welcome back to Daily Hope. Today's verse is one of these really, really short verses that is just packed with meaning. Let me read it to you, and then we'll unpack what it means. Verse 23 of Proverb 28 says this, In the end, people appreciate honest criticism more than flattery. Hmm, is it true? that people appreciate honest criticism more than flattery? Well, the key is those three words, in the end. I can tell you this. Honest criticism, let's define what that means. It's not critiquing to be mean or judgmental. It's not being a perfectionist and nobody ever lives up. It's you see a friend and they're making a choice and you know the choice is gonna hurt them and you come to them in love and you say, I'm, I'm not saying this because I think I'm better. I don't have it all figured out, but can I just be honest? I believe that if you make that choice, it's gonna harm you. Now, let me tell you from life experience, you can have the purest of motives, you can deliver it as gently as possible, and you will be misunderstood when you give honest criticism like that. Another proverb that says, wounds from a friend can be trusted, but wounds from a friend, aren't always trusted. People get defensive, people have egos, people get upset. And so in the beginning, honest criticism where you really want the best for the other person, it's often refused and sometimes people will even reject you or misunderstand you. But then time happens, life happens. Months and years pass or even decades and that person to whom you gave the honest criticism they come to realize not only that you were right, but that you were trying to help them and protect them. And that same person will look back at the people who flattered them. The people who, to use an analogy, if you're like, I'm gonna drive my car off a cliff, what do you think? And the one friend says, I love you, I really don't think it's a good idea. And the other friends, the drinking buddies, the unwise people are all like, hey, go for it. It's your life, do whatever you want. And in the moment, you'd feel like, wow, those people are on my side, but then you drive your car off the cliff. And in the end, when your car is smashed at the bottom and you're wounded, you realize, oh, that one person who gave me the advice I didn't want was the one person who loved me enough to tell me what I needed to hear. So let's be people who receive honest criticism. And when you are called to give honest criticism, don't let a person's initial pushback discourage you. In the end, people do appreciate honest criticism far more than flattery. See you tomorrow for more Daily Hope.